This is the book of Deuteronomy, chapter 28, verse 32. Thy sons and thy daughters shall be given unto another people, and thy eyes shall look and fail with longing for them all the day long, and there shall be no might in thy hand. First and foremost, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father's only God and Son, Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashim, Rekakwadash. <clears throat> Double honors to our apostles and elders, a great millstone, teach us his truth, according to the Bible, and we're well. A notch of the one, not a sincere Akim, throughout the four corners of the earth, pushing his truth through diligence and sincerity and in charity. And a notch of the one, not your sincere followers, believers of Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh Shai, not just hears the word, but doers as well, you men, women, and children, and hopefully, like Shalom. You know, I saw this video, and um, we're going to play it in just a second. Um, and uh, maybe think about Deuteronomy 28. I mean, these are curses that will be put upon the Lord's people, the Israelites, the so-called Negroes, the Latinos, the Native American Indians. Okay, um, wherever we were scattered, that our sons and our daughters will be given to another people. And this is talking about, um, you know, being carted off. You know, cargo slave ships being sold on auction blocks. And we would, uh, you know, our eyes would look and fail longing for them all the day long. And there would be no might in our hand because we have no power. We were subject to these curses. And um, in this video, it made me think about this because this guy, um, you know, wasn't able to see his daughter. And, um, you know, the mother had all the power, all the control due to Esau Edom uplifting the woman, all right, and um, putting us up under these uh, 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 hellish conditions, right? And um, it just made me think about, you know, the, 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 this will be going, this is what Jacob will be going through, no matter what Jacob looks like, right? Because we were scattered, so we're going to be looking like all these other nations. And, um, you know, just something doing on, on, on you know, Got a little second from work, so just um, not quite sure what my title's lesson, but what was other fine? We're gonna play it and grab some more scriptures and wrap it on up. <laughs> It's not even your kid. He's not Stop. taking her. He's gonna talk. Stop. We're not He's just gonna talk don't, to her. Don't He's just gonna talk to her. Do not touch me. Just not touch her. Hey. 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 Make you it don't. talk. Don't have a disturbance in front of all these people and all these children. You have no people saying you can take her. I want to talk to her. Now, this is his daughter, and as you can see, the one guy. I guess he's the new, the new, uh, the new man in the relationship. All right, and. You know, he he's you know probably looking at one sided through the through the through the woman's perspective and things of that nature, but at the end of the day, that man's child is that man's property, all right. And you know, it just makes me think about you know we're still slaves, man. We have no control over our property because slaves don't have property, okay. Your children is is, is your property, and it says here it says Daddy just wants a moment to let Ellis know he calls two times a day. Asking to see, asking to see her, asking to talk to her. Her mother is alienating her. There is no paperwork. <clears throat> All right. So apparently they haven't uh, went through the courts, the court system yet, which is all wicked as hell. Um, which we'll we'll get a scripture on that real fast. Um, This is a uh, because Esau passed all types of unrighteous laws and decrees um, to keep Jake down. And, and though he looked like an Edomite, you know, these curses are upon Jacob, man. And that do very right well just be an Israelite. Uh, so this Isaiah 10 and 1 is a woe to him, which means destruction that decree unrighteous decrees. The whole court system, this man's law system is all wicked. And it's all to oppress you Israelites, so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. But yet our people still trust in this man and his ways. What's well, going to be to your demise? Scripture says, woe to them to go down to Egypt for help. You know, through voting and things of that nature. 
We need to be leaning on the Lord. But anyways, Isaiah 10 and 1 says, Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees. And who's in power to, to decree these uh, laws? Esau, the so-called white man. Esau is his uh, uh, biblical nationality, the Edomites. They go back to a man named Esau. You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians go back to a man named Jacob. And we've been scattered amongst these nations for our transgressions. So therefore, we're going to look like the nations. Some of us, right? But it says, and right grievousness, which they have prescribed. And the whole uh, court system, when it deals with... Um, you know, men having their children is not in their favor, and it grieves the man. All right, it grieves the man, and that's why we got to get up out of here because this place is purely wicked, man. It says, To turn aside the needy from judgment and to take away the right from the poor of my people, that widows may be their prey, and they that may rob the fatherless. It says, well, I'll come back to that. Hold on. I want to finish this out real fast, real quick. I'm going to run it back some. Run it back to the beginning. All right. At this time, if we would like parents to come down, students will stay down here. Hey, he's not safe. You're going to Like, how dare you try to, you know what I'm saying, rescue the daughter from her, 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 own, her own father? You know? And that's all a, 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 a product of, of, of Esau's ways. He has turned things upside down. Hey, stop, hey, that's not even your kid. He's not stop. taking her. Stop. He's gonna talk. Stop. Not He's just gonna talk don't, to her. Don't He's just gonna talk to her. Do not touch me. Just gonna talk to her. Hey, hey, they can talk. Don't have a disturbance in front of all these people and all these children. And do you hear? You hear? You hear? You hear that? Uh, he can give her a hug and then she has to go. That's that man's seed. That's why a lot of you women, according to Ezekiel the ninth chapter, are going to pay. So I, I, I've lived it, man. I've, I've, I've had, you know, a woman hold my seed against me, hold my son against me. If I didn't give into her ways. You have no people saying you can take her. I want to talk to her. I'm not going to take her. Yeah. Hey, I want to talk to her. Listen, listen. <sighs> Look at her. She's a demon, y'all. And, you know, I, I'm, I'm just, you know, calling it from what it is through the video. I mean, you know, telling what's really going on. But it's just, it's, it's, this place is it's just wicked, man. You know, all right? It, 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 it grieves mainly the men, the Israelite men. So let's grab one last one, wrapping on up. Um, let's go to... Um, Revelation. Let me see. Matter of fact, I'll get two. Uh, yeah, 21. Yeah, it's Revelation 21 and 4. And yeah, how was your wipe away all tears from their eyes? Because best believe, you know, uh, it's just like men love being fathers, man, for the majority of the part. You know, right? We've been giving a bad rap saying we don't like to take care of our children. And um, the, the children doesn't, doesn't belong to us, doesn't need to be with us. All right. And those are tears that are all going to go away once the Lord comes back and set things in order. That's why we're supposed to be hasting in a righteous kingdom, man. Revelation 21 and 4, and your house shall wipe away all tears from their eyes, and there shall be no more death, neither sorrow, nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain, for the former things are passed away. And these things are going to be passed away, man. It's a dream. All right, we're going to wake up in the kingdom of heaven. I have to worry about, you know, our, our, our children um, being up on a... a a unruly woman. Okay, a woman is not in order. Okay. We're not using the child against you because you mad at, the, at, at, at your husband. All right. And then that one Jake going off, that's that that's not your business. 
that's not your business. Okay, they're not together no more, but it's not your business to come in and, 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 and you know, uh, try to save the, uh, the daughter, okay? It's not, it's not his property. It's not his business. And for you Edomites, right, and you other heathens, all these things that the Israelites went through, you're going to go through it yourselves. You're going to go through it yourselves, man. What's that uh, 30th chapter? All these curses that was put upon us are going to be put upon you. You're going to go through it. This is Deuteronomy 30 and 7. It says, And the Lord thy power will put all these curses upon thy enemies and upon them that hate thee, which persecute thee. And that time is coming, man. All right. You're going to have to go through it, Esau, broken families, your woman not with you, your woman against you, your children against you, you against all odds, right? The laws, the decrees are not going to be in your favor, my man. And you're not going to have no drugs, no alcohol, no nothing to take that pain away. Giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father, His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Yahweh, Ba'ashim, Ba'ashim, Double honors are apostles. That was a great millstone. Shalom.